What's up mga karuba? This is your Kanyo Boy Apong Glenn Rapping English Ilocano Aglalok And today Today We are here in Governor Roque Ablan Senior Shrine uh, Today I will tell you a trivia about the Legacy and the heroism of Governor Roque Ablan Senior uh, He is one of the reasons why we have a long weekend Last weekend <laughs> But unluckily, at uh, napiksa tudo hindi ko hindi ko ay so nga madimi na ipapaste nagbakasyon. Don't you know that Governor Roque Ablan Sr. is known for his bravery and heroism during the invasion of the Japanese forces in the country? I will tell you a story about him. When the Japanese troops landed in Brigan, Ablan refused to extend his cooperation to them as governor of Ilocos Norte. He left Lawag, the provincial capital, to avoid arrest and led the organization of guerrilla units in coordination with Lieutenant Feliciano Madamba of the Philippine Army. Their first encounter with the enemy took place when Madamba's unit successfully ambushed a Japanese detachment in Banna killing about 50 Japanese soldiers on January 28, 1942. Ablan's guerrillas had a series of bitter skirmishes with the Japanese. After Bataan and Corregidor had been fallen, the Japanese forces under the command of Colonel Watanabe established their headquarters in Lawag. The enemy hunted Ablan and his resistance fighters. Air units dropped leaflets urging him and his men to surrender. He refused to give up the struggle. On November 8, 1942, Ablan launched a successful attack against Japanese patrols in Pampaniki, Solsona. On December 10 that same year, he left for Cagayan to offer with Governor Marcelo Aduro. Reportedly, his last words to his family were, How I hate myself for having only one life to give to my country. But don't cry, I will be back when liberty returns to our people. He never came back and what had become of him remains a mystery to these days. Hangkan ko nagsusubli di ko So, before Gerald Anderson was not talking to Bey Alonso, ghosting was real. Ghosting, pauso pa yung ni Quadeta, ni Roque Ablan. Kitam ko di nagparparang. Timan mga tawa, hindi pulos nagparparangin. Regent yung usos nung ghosting. <laughs> he probably perished during an encounter with the Japanese. Or maybe he was captured na Tiliwiso na. Imprisoned and subsequently executed to the by the enemy. Mabalin nga. Bitin ngayon muna, J. Karay kayo na. Kasi sada, pinitik-pitik, J. Karay na. <laughs> His heroic deeds have earned him an honored place in our country's history. Nagbalin isuna nga hero. As of today, Ablan Day is observed pursuant to Republic Act number 6941. This states that August 9, every year, is declared as Governor Roque Ablan Senior Day, a special non-working holiday. Non-working, madi tayo agub-ubra. <laughs> in the province of Ilocos Norte. And that's it. That is another trivia from Apong Glen. And I hope you learned something. This is Apong Glen. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs>